All right, what's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Randy here with RTS Mobile. I am bringing you a fantastic video today. We are playing some Infinity Kingdom, and I am going to be showcasing uh, one of the favorite heroes for the water attribute. His name is Attila the Hun, and he is a baller. Uh, this is going to be a short and sweet video, so make sure you hit the like and sub and stay tuned for the next one or two or three days. This is going to be a mathematically focused analytical video, so get excited. Here we go. First things first, right? Attila the Hun, Scourge of God. He is fantastic. Here he has his uh, primary ability, his built-in ability, the Wild Corrosion, which knocks up all the enemy targets, inflicting massive physical damage uh, and 50% chance to silence them and keep them from generating energy for four seconds. So we have a damage and a debuff, okay? Uh, and that's going to be really important because in just a second, I'm going to jump into the math. Now, uh... His ability doesn't do a ton of damage compared to some of these other mortals, but it does half decent damage. Uh, he's also a very tanky hero, as you can see his physical attack and physical defense are both very high. His magical defense is very high, and actually, surprisingly, uh, for a slightly uh, more defense-oriented uh, hero, he is uh, heavy on crit, so he has a lot of crit and dodge both, which is nice to see. Uh, okay, and the most important part about Attila the Hun is his energy regen is phenomenal, which means he's going to be popping out his skill ability every 12 seconds plus or minus, okay? Now, let's talk about the math. Let me just hop open to my spreadsheet here. I like my spreadsheets. Here it is. Look at that. Okay, here we have Attila the Hun, right? Let me make sure. Yeah, we got Attila the Hun here. Boom. Okay. His ability is Wild Corrosion, as you can see, attacks enemies in a fan, so it hits three enemies, right, and a chance to silence for four, uh, for four seconds. His overall effect type is physical. It is offensive. It is an 11.9 second interval if he doesn't get CC'd, and it does a total of 41 DPS when striking three targets. So 41 DPS plus 12 seconds of potential uh, skill debuff time uh, here with his primary skill. Now, the recommended builds for Attila the Hun is actually the build I'm running right now. Uh, as you can see here, I am uh, running, uh, I've got Adrenaline Rush to uh, be able to activate my skill quicker because I'm focusing on having this guy as a Mega CC, which means he just spam CC all day nonstop. So Adrenaline, adrenaline Rush will give him about 4% uh, faster uh, skill use. In addition, we have Silence, which is going to be uh, a 31.5% chance every uh, 6 seconds of doing damage and silencing. And then, of course, Fighting Master, which makes him more tanky and immune to CC, which means he'll never stop silencing. Okay, now let's put that on to the spreadsheet and see how the math pans out. So, uh, we said Adrenaline Rush. Boom. Okay, chance on hit. Two second intervals. It gives you about a 4% overall buff, like I said, to your energy regen. It sounds like a lot more on paper, when, but when you think about it, uh, it's only regenerating a portion of an energy bar every couple seconds with a chance on hit. So it's not guaranteed, it's not constant, and it's, uh, it's not giving you a whole energy bar. It's giving you a fraction of an energy bar, okay? Uh, the next skill we talked about putting on there, what was that? Which was it? We had Silence, which is great because it puts CC. Let's just jump down. Oops. Jump down to silence here. Where's the S's at? There it is. Silence. Okay. Chance to physical damage and silence. Physical. It's an offensive skill. Six second interval. It does a total of 8% DPS, uh, which isn't the point of the skill. It's not a DPS based skill, but it does provide 4 CC per use. Uh, potential for 4 seconds of CC per use. And then we said Fighting Master, because that is going to make him fantastic super duper strong and able to go ahead and uh and rock and roll so fighting master is going to give you of course a cc immunity and uh reduced damage taken it is an aura it is defensive uh since it's constant it's at a one second interval and its total defense uh, percentage added to your life is going to be 11 percent in addition to the uh ability to not get cc'd which is extremely nice so that is attila the hun here uh his overall dps from this build again he's not dps centered in this build he's cc centered his overall dps is 49 percent okay 
Uh, he's got 11% uh, defense boost, uh, and then no healing. He's got a total of 16 uh, seconds worth of CC that he can roll uh, run through every cycle if his RNG procs, and then he doesn't really provide uh, much of a buff. Adrenaline Rush, like I said, gives you about a 4% uh, energy regen bon uh, bonus there, and no debuffs. So, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for the next video where we go through another fantastic immortal. Uh, talk about the math and look at different skill builds for them, okay? Love you guys long time. Uh, Alright. Randy out.